Hey guys, this is MK with Citra Emulator News. The official version has been released. Yes, no MMJ. I'm going to leave the link in the description so you can try it. The app requires a minimum of 64-bit Android 8 and OpenGL ES 3.2 support. As for hardware, the developers recommend the device with a Snapdragon 8 35 or better. So what's the difference with the MMJ version? The official utilizes the camera from your device. It's required in some games or for scanning QR codes. You can use the front or back camera and take pictures, even at better quality than the original 3DS. The developers added support for motion controls using the gyroscopes that exist in almost every Android device. This is great news for people that didn't like to use a touchscreen, makes it feel like a real 3DS. The speed has been improved for a lot of games. Super Mario 3D Land uses to be played between 20 and 60 FPS, but now you can play it at full speed. Is the official version better than MMJ? Not at all. We lost FMV and Texture Hack. FMV Hack was used to make the videos run at full speed, and Texture Hack was used for games with graphical glitches, such as Metal Gear, Monster Hunter, and Resident Evil games. And more important, we lost Trailer Cash. Yes, it was a big improvement playing with it, making the game more playable without stutter. Now you need to compile the shaders every time you load a game. It doesn't matter how many hours you play, because when you load it, again it will stutter. There's no option for shit goes, so you need to use the MMJ version to enable or disable it, since both uses the same folder. Not all the games that use it to run in MMJ works. Super Street Fighter 4, Monster Hunter, and Resident Evil games doesn't. It might be something about the empty framework mobile that Capcom uses in those games. Can it run this game? I don't have all the games, but I'm going to try to make a list or videos with some of theirs. You can find them in my channel. After answering all those questions, here is some gameplay.
trees there. They could provide cover. Remember, always use the surrounding terrain to your advantage. That was all for today. I will let you know if there's any update about the emulator, so subscribe for that. See you soon!